how closely do you think it follows your um your life oh quite a lot yeah yes. no quite a lot, really. quite a lot. It, yeah, no, no, actually it's quite nice. Lily, Lily was reading it the other day and she's going, so did that actually happen? Did that actually happen? Yeah. Like, you know? And a lot of it is, I mean, obviously what I'm doing with the books are, are um, I'm literally, I'm picking the settings that almost I can see it and there are experiences and there's, you know, um, characters that I can think of that like particularly in the theater. I mean, obviously I think I'm portraying mum and dad mum comes into the next book um more pretty much as our relationships were you know yeah. and, uh, and it was all very much a working environment you know and that's what they did and I genuinely loved it and I loved and the, the pattern of it all is but obviously I'm taking it a little bit into fiction with the story and yeah. the tale that happens you know so but but then but there are a lot of it you know like I talk about um you know the horses backstage there were horses there were you know there were always I know, it's amazing yeah a lot of those things were true you know so that as in i i remember those things so lots of the the life backstage and animals and children and um and how that all worked and the the, the pattern so although so yeah so it was it is very much the setting is is what I how I remember and I wanted to portray that it's actually it was it was you know as an adult and now as a mum you kind of you really appreciate that growing up you know and whereas at the time you 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 I enjoyed it I didn't not love any of it but it was you don't appreciate it no you take it for granted <laughs> yeah you know, sort of that's what we did and um you know and I've uh, so that there was lots of I mean to be honest I was I could think so I've got six books it's a series of six yeah and there were lots that I could choose from you know lots of settings so I've got things like one is set the next one is set um the next one I'm working on is set in uh the Regent's Park open air theatre which is a lovely okay. setting Very because well. yeah because I remember mum did a season there and I think I was about 13 12 maybe when when mum did the summer season there and it was it was really quite magical there and i yeah. really remember it. um do you think the um do you think it will encourage um children to go sort of backstage or to you know because you describe it really well in terms of you know there are more jobs in in acting than just acting do you know what, yeah. I mean? you know what? and that's brilliant and i always say that to my kids you know that that when I was talking about, you know, describing it, I genuinely, I never wanted to go on the stage. I wanted to do all of the jobs backstage, all of them. I just thought they were all brilliant. I, at one point I wanted to be a costume designer. One minute I wanted to be a lighting designer because I'd sit there and just watch all these lights and how they worked and, and creating. And of course, in some of the bigger venues, it was amazing. And the sound guys, yeah, you know, and you know, when the sound was right, everyone was so happy when you get it right. And, you know, and, and like some of these venues were, were difficult and you had to really know your job to get that right, depending on what it is that you're trying to project. And then, but the, on the other side as well, I really, I, I, and actually I would still love to be a cameraman. I still think <laughs> like he as a cameraman. <laughs> I love, I really love to watch. I love to go to the studios when we went down. Because often I get pick up on a Friday night from school and then we'd go down to the um, studios, the BBC studios, and watch the inside bits of Heidi High being filmed. So I would, you know, and that, that was really fun, because it's like going yeah. to the theatre for the night, you know, but live, and it was yeah, all yeah. like, and then they'd stop. And, but you'd seen that all come together as well. I just thought, it, oh, I loved it. And I, like I say now, I still love to sit and watch the technical side and green screening and all that, you know, and how they do all of this and bring it all yeah. together. I, yeah, and I hope so. I hope that if, if um, you know, if um, if that gives that insight, if the books can give an insight to the other side, yeah, the you know the the skills that are needed and or the or um, and the joy that I think a lot of people have, you know, from their their creative the creativity as well that goes yeah, on. Yeah. You know, you know, I think about the time I was at the Lyceum which is where the Lion King is on now. And I, I left actually the, the um, I left the Lyceum just as the Lion King was coming in. So I saw we had quite a bit of time. We had to almost, we had to do quite a bit of work to the auditorium there. 
And, um, but you know, you think about how simple it looks, but it's not, it's so. It, they make it's it so look easy. Yeah. And yeah. It, was, it was beautiful, you know, that was a really fabulous production. So you kind of, you know, but there's and lots of things like that and watching like hydraulics work in the staging and how they make things yeah. evolve. And um, yeah, I loved all that. Really? And I, so I've got more of that to come in the books, you know. But